Good morning, everyone. So right now we are in the beautiful town of Frederickstead. And um, honestly, we're not exactly sure what this place has to offer in terms of just like to do anything. To do anything. We're just walking around right now. We're used to getting up and early, um, you know, just up and out and about early in the morning. And right now it's almost 10 o'clock, but we keep forgetting we're on island time. So I don't think anything opens up until 11. So right now we're just walking, trying to see what there is. Um, we heard from a lot of people to go to the Fred. So we'll definitely try that place for lunch. And then we'll just see how much longer we're gonna be here. It's very, very historic down here. There's a lot of um, like memorials for anyone who's in the Army, Navy, Coast Guard, anything like that. Um, and then uh, there's like just old building, just very old. It's just a very old town, so. Yeah, it's a very nice historic, you know, area. Um, just not a lot to do, so we're just gonna keep walking around and try to figure out, um, you know, what, what, what to do. <laughs> Yo, what's up? So I have my waterproof case on right now, so I can't take it off. Oh, just splash water by. But right now, we are snorkeling at the pier in Fredrickston. It is freaking awesome, so we're gonna try to get some cool shots. Live fish, sea Baby, that's turtle. a turtle right under wait, you. Wait, Good afternoon. We just finished snorkeling and it was absolutely amazing. That water was so clear and well, we actually really like this town. It just seems, you know, it was just really dead in the beginning, but like we said earlier, um, you know, just have to wait because it's island time. So now that it's like afternoon, everything is just opened up. Um, there's just a lot more life now. So. We just finished snorkeling. It's such a very nice day. You will not believe what we saw. Four sea turtles. Four. Yes, they, they were really awesome looking and we just kept chasing them down. Um, <laughs> so right now we are going to the Fred to get some lunch. We've heard a lot of good things about it, so we're very excited. And then, and then I don't know, we might just head back to the resort after that. It's, it's still pretty hot. Yesterday yeah. was one of the hotter days. Just everyone on the island said how hot it was. Um, so we're gonna probably just have a relaxing afternoon and probably go to our um, little food place at the resort this evening. Yep. Just see.
We just woke up from a nap. Um, we just, <laughs> we were just beat up today just from all the snorkeling and all the sun just made us really tired. So we took a nap. Right now Shelby's taking a shower and I am just enjoying this wonderful view. Um, let's see if I can get an awesome shot here. Let's see. Look at that, that is just absolutely amazing. It doesn't get better than that at all. So for the rest of the day, we are just going to chill. And then tomorrow, I believe, we're just going to chill at the resort here as well. Um, you know, just really enjoy our last full day here at the resort. We're just super excited. Um, you know, sad too, just because, you know, it's our last day at the resort, but we're excited to go back to the States. And then we're going to Myrtle Beach for 10 days after that. So, you know, the honeymoon is not yet over. All right, while Shelby is taking a shower, I am going to get us some pizza right now. So we are gonna take just a little walk over to the bar area where they make some of the best food here. So that's where we're going right now. Also something that I want to mention is that we are just very grateful that we're here at the Carambola Beach Resort. Honestly, out of all the places that we could have stayed, this is the best place, absolutely. Even though it's far away from everything, such as like the stores and restaurants and all of that, this is just paradise. Um, we went to other places such as, you know, the Hotel on the K and the Fred, and those places are super nice, but just compared to this, this is absolutely paradise. So without a doubt, we are just so grateful and happy that we are here at Campbell Beach Resort. Just got the towels and also, I can't remember if I told you guys, but on this island, everywhere that you go, no matter if you go into the offices, the stores, anything, even when we had to take our little boat ride over to the Hotel in the K, you absolutely have to have a face mask on. It's just their mandatory island laws here. So yeah, just if you guys ever come to St. Croix or any of the US Virgin Islands, especially during this whole pandemic, make sure that you have a face mask. just hanging out on the beach watching the beautiful sunset and I felt something land on my head so then naturally I just go like this because you know I felt something on my hair and then I just felt this sharp pain and then I looked at my finger I don't know if you can even see it you can barely see it. it's actually kind of going away but um yeah there was a there was a stinger um there so I pretty much I got stung by a bee and then we saw the bee land on the sand and I have not felt pain like that in a while so I started kicking sand at that bee. I was not very happy. So then I just let the ocean, you know, take take the bee away. But um, yeah, I got sung by a murder hornet in St. Croix. Today is our very last day here at the resort, our last full day. So we're just going to enjoy and relax here. And we actually just got room service and I will show you. The first meal that we got here was a grilled mahi-mahi sandwich. Got that. That just looks very delicious. And then Shelby got a jerk chicken sandwich as well. But right now what we are going to do is we are going to eat and just enjoy the rest of you know the day together. We're going down to the beach for the last time while we're here, except later tonight when we go down to watch the sunset. But yeah, just gonna be the last time that we get to go on the beach here. And Shelby is in a lot of pain because she got sunburned when yesterday. Yeah, whenever we went snorkeling, yeah. I didn't put as much sunscreen on my back as I needed. 
So she's in some pain right now, but we're still going to just enjoy the beach for the last time. And yeah. having dinner on our final night here. And can we just appreciate my good looking wife? Like, oh my goodness, look at her. Ooh, yes, yes. I am so blessed. Thank you, sir. It's our last day. Last hour. Yeah, so we're saying goodbye to the beautiful beach. It's our last hour here. We already called our taxi to come pick us up, so he's on his way right now. And well, it's just time to say goodbye to the beach for the last time. I'm trying not to get stung here. Um, so we're just gonna take one last look of the beach, say our goodbyes, and just be on our way back home. Thank you. <laughs>